Listen up, fam. The day has finally come. We finally have a new way, an easy way, a simple way, a native way to install Android APKs on the MetaQuest platform. Let's not waste any time. Let's get into it right now. All right, we're skipping the intro here because it's not important. What is important is you understanding that VR Android File Manager, a true file manager for Quest, is absolutely in the MetaQuest store. I want to prove it to you now by the close out all of these other applications. Open up the navigator here and go to the store. Watch what happens. I'm just going to bring this close so we can make sure we can see everything. I'm going to hit search here and I'm going to type in VR Android file manager look at that guys we click on that as soon as we get in we're going to see the application right there and it's crazy simple there is no more steps here you literally hit the start button open it up you can see that at 7 20 this morning like because i literally just got into this this morning and saw this i'm like so excited i went in and i updated epic games i'm gonna show you how it works once again nothing crazy it just jumps us right into where we install apks that we downloaded i downloaded these with my browser um this is an official apk from epic games nothing uh that's you know from any other pirated type store nothing like that official official epic games apk here I can hit open, it brings it right up, and then I can get into the game that I enjoy so much, a game like Fall Guys. Boom, it's up. I, like, do you understand how quick that was? I don't, I don't think y'all understand. I literally went to the store. I literally searched for the application. I downloaded the application, started it, installed, and was inside of Fall Guys in a matter of, of, of literally seconds. I mean, technically just seconds, y'all. Like, this is something we have been waiting on for Quest for the longest now. One quick clarification I wanna make sure because I know this may come up in conversation. I wanna go ahead and click the, into the navigator. A lot of people are gonna ask, where do the files go once you actually have them installed? They go to an area called unknown sources. So if you're in the new navigator system, you're gonna go click on unknown sources uh, and then you'll see it right here. That's literally all you have to do to see all the applications that you have installed. And just for the record, one more time, I want to make this clear verbally as well. You want to make sure that you're downloading official APKs, Meta, Google, getting things done. Do not condone in any way, shape or form downloading pirated applications. So make sure you download official APKs that you either own or you're getting officially from the store. Seems to be truly official. In fact, the application has been in here since almost 19 days ago, at least based off this review, it's at least been released for a little bit. So I'm, I'm believing that maybe it's possible that Meta has understand that power users want to use uh, more things on their quest other than what is coming in the store. So they're given some ability here by allowing this, uh, this particular developer. Shout out to them for taking the time to build this, to bring this into the ecosystem, to allow us to simply just install APKs I've been asking for this feature for years officially from Meta, so it's just really cool to see in the store we now have that ability. I, I mean, there's really nothing else to show. You can go ahead and download VR Android File Manager right now. Link is in the description. And listen, it's really, really cool. But you know what else is really, really cool? You know what else you should continue to pay attention to? Mm -hmm. this channel. So why don't you subscribe? Why don't you hit the thumbs up? Why don't you comment below? Let us know how much you enjoy this content and hitting that bell notification so you can know the next time my video comes because I promise you, we got a lot more content coming real soon. It's your boy, Jay Dunn, and I'll see you next time. Peace.